Okay, this shit didn't come with a keyboard, so I am about to take my third L of the day and go to Target to purchase one for probably 200 fucking dollars, which I'm not very happy about, but it could be worse. So, I'm just going to go to the ghetto Target near me because I know they have it. Yo, what the hell? They are really trying to push this color, huh? Almost accidentally cut through the maternity segment of the store. <sighs> I stay away from that shit. Alexa. 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 Alexa, why am I. Alexa, why is my brain slow? Alexa. Hmm. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what, do they have like a dog in here? I got my keyboard and I, well, I can't believe how I look right now. I paid more than I would like to admit and more than I would have liked to have paid. But regardless, I got the thing and um, yeah, that's it. It's here. Having it plugged into here, this feels really ghetto and I feel like it's going to be <laughs> get set on fire, especially because my outlet's not super secured. Um, th but I do pay extra just in case anything happens to my apartment that they do require me to pay. So I mean, if anything happens to me, please do not laugh at me. I'm using my ghetto mouse today that I got when I- Oh, fuck yeah, it still works! That I got when I was like, I don't know, 16, 15 maybe. Because I really want the rose gold fucking mouse. And I'm willing to wait for it. This is fucking cool. Okay, let me enjoy it. I've never had an iMac before or any type of Macintosh, whatever. I have to download the Mac OS. So just to plug this in. Nice. Cool. Oh, it's heavier than I thought it would be. All right. I guess I'm just gonna plug it in, right? Is this not H? It's not USB C. Damn. How is this not a USB C? That's nuts. Um, is that okay? Fuck it. It weighs nothing actually. It weighs like nothing at all. I feel like I spent two hundred dollars on a piece of junk. I actually can't even use this cord that came with it because my computer's too old. So that's cool, I guess. I'm going to find a different one. Right? Right? Did this go to iPhone? I think this one's USB-C too. Yeah, fuck. Don't laugh at me. I found this. It's from the dollar store um, a few years ago, but I think it might work. I don't think it works. Oh fuck, I don't think it works. I think I'm gonna have to go down and get my fucking car charger just to get this keyboard to connect. <laughs> I'm not even joking. <sighs> Does it turn on? Like something I have to do. Oh. Is that it? Oh, it works. Wait. <laughs> my dollar store cable works. Okay. So update i actually can't get os on this um i don't know what the issue is i reprogrammed the time and i connected the wi-fi and i always get the recovery server cannot be contacted i just got it again so right now i'm going to use my og my baby my oh the beast that has done me so well for all of these years so this is gonna download on my drive and then i'm gonna have to it looks like literally code it into the uh, yeah it didn't work I did get it working. It does work now, but it did take a lot. Turn on. It's on. <laughs> Excuse me, what? That's exactly how I feel. No. In a nutshell, um, everything on Apple is working fine, so it's my problem. So I just typed in a bunch of code and i'm just gonna hope it works and i um okay it didn't so next. oh no i fucked it up oh no oh no that that's not good um so what did i just 
Dots even worse. Oh, okay, so it went from showing literally like basically Mac version of Windows blue screen um, to just X. So I don't know what's going on. Um, let's go to support.apple. So I'm going to give as much context as I possibly can for what, um, let me explain what went on yesterday. For anyone who's like new to the channel or just doesn't know, I make music. Like I just make a shit ton of music. Like there's guitars everywhere in here. Um, like there's a keyboard over there. Shit, like there's, I just need to get better. So I needed to pick up a keyboard. I was able to get it off Marketplace. Um, but what's was important to me is I really needed like a good studio setup for myself so that I can make some stuff that um, I'm more proud of. To be honest, I'll be able to do way more things with um, the keyboard that I ended up being able to buy. And then um, same with big old MacBook here, even though it does have some issues that needs an OS and I need to go to be, uh, fix it. Um, <laughs> And then I'm getting my desk like tomorrow. Just saying, like it's super doable. Like if you just if you really want to do something, you set your mind out to it, you can do it. And I feel like I'm a good example of that sometimes. Uh, it is very late, and it's been a very long day for me. And I can't believe what's going on right now. But basically, Apple support. Him told me to go fuck myself um i wish i was joking they didn't say that exact words but they did tell me to go fuck myself it's having software issues and i've had it for about 24 hours and i've just been trying to troubleshoot them and at first they gave me like a lot of support like they were telling me all this shit like what to do and i'm like okay i've already done all of that because i had and um then they gave up on me and um stopped answering me it started disconnecting me and I was like, okay. And then they didn't allow me to get support over the computer anymore. They were like, you must enter in the serial number. And then they were like, we're not gonna give you support. I'm like, I don't understand. And then I tried it again today. And I got this thing yesterday. It's been having the same shit. It won't install the OS. It's like, it runs high Sierra. It's old as fuck. And apparently they just stopped the servers that install that. So I have to do it manually, which I also tried. And I just, my guess is that I can't use my Google hard drive to use as a bootable installer. I'm not sure, but I have to make one. So I probably have to buy a fucking flash drive for that shit, which I don't want to do, but it's just what I'm going to have to do. I'm, I'm, I have to get someone to fix this. <laughs> oh, fuck. I'm fucking out of ideas. I don't <laughs> They even suggested I fucking bring it to the Apple store. I'm like... <sighs> so I told them I need help with mid-2011 Mac. And they're like, okay, yeah, let me help. And then they like go on, I give them the serial number. And then <laughs> I get this message. This was hysterical. Um, I do want to let you know this device is considered vintage. It's literally from 2011 it's 12 years old what the fuck is 12 years old that is considered fucking vintage i can't think of a single thing i still want to do what i can to help and then they continue to share the same shit with me that they shared the other day and um i've already tried again so i'm like fuck i just have to literally program the entire thing by myself and now here's the kicker this is where it gets good they're like, you can bring it in person. I'm like, so I need to, <laughs> this is what I literally wrote. <laughs> so I need to bring that heavy ass MacBook that I cannot carry all the way to the middle of Tampa where I will get robbed trying to go to the Apple store with it. I don't understand. <laughs> it seems pretty fucking fair to me. It, 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 the computer is so heavy. Let me Google how much this shit weighs. It's literally like 30 pounds. It's like an anvil. I would call it an anvil because, again, I can't believe this shit is 30 pounds. It feels like it's heavier. 
and if I were to compare it to anything, I would find it comparable to an anvil, to be honest. I would not want to let that thing fall on me. If it would fall on my head, it would be like a cartoon, and I would, I would not survive. And there's no way I'm gonna bring that shit to the International Mall in the middle of Tampa. That's where the fucking nearest Alpha store is. I'm not fucking doing that. I guess just wish me the fucking best of luck with the iMac. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Apple's attitude towards me was literally like, fuck you, it's too old, and we are not helping you. Well, I love the old iMac. And it's cool. It's two in the morning, I'm going to bed.